Okay, hello, it's working. Yes, my name is Yaz. I was the Queen Mary Students' Union Press in 2017-18. I ran way back when because I wanted to change the SU up, um, but also because I was very democratically engaged. Uh, I was involved in, as a part-time officer and heavily involved in societies. And I really valued sort of like student-led leadership. So it was kind of a given that I would run for the role. My best memory of it would have been the whole elections process when I was doing it and campaigning, um, getting all my friends to support the cause, getting people to vote for me. Uh, we had huge, huge turnout in votes and I loved it. I thought it was absolutely amazing. Not because obviously um, you become a bit of a beanock, a big name on campus, um, but because it's a great opportunity for you to speak to some of your friends and others and really figure out what they want in the ESU, what they want to change and become a public figure that way. And I thought it was really cool for me. One of my biggest achievements would have been refurbishing the hive, which then became the nest. Uh, it was a great like sort of campaign developed throughout my journey as a prez. And it really um, helped me not just give back to the students, but also develop me as a professional leader. So I figured out, oh, this is the kind of skills I need to do in order to get things that I need to get in life <laughs> through work. So um, it's a really good achievement that I always mention even now in interviews. Um, if you're thinking about running, definitely do it. And if you're not thinking about running, maybe this could help. Uh, I think it's invaluable being a sabbatical officer especially now as students um if you are political i think it's uh, it's giving you an edge as it is because you're naturally going to be wanting to gear towards um sort of like political leadership but if you're not political i think maybe wonder what kind of skills you you want to develop after you graduate and a lot of them you get as a sabbatical officer but whether that be prez or whether that be one of the other roles that was um created so I would definitely suggest to you uh, as students, even if you're not thinking about it, maybe just just look at it, see what uh, the, the job descriptions or the person specification looks like. And um, yeah, if, it, if it's something you're kind of interested in, definitely do it because you won't get an experience quite like this. I mean, maybe you get lucky, but it's very rare to be propelled into a managerial position straight after you finish your degree. So definitely do it. One piece of advice I'd say for anyone who does want to run to, to, to run, um, make sure you look after yourself during that whole process because trust me, it gets tough. I sacrificed my trim, my haircut <laughs> when I ran for the elections basically because uh, it messed up my hairline. <laughs> uh, but make sure you look after yourself in some way, uh, whether that be a break or whatever it is, I think it'd be invaluable for you to relax. So yeah.